is Saturday the 23rd warming it up uh, hopefully enough charge in the battery we're gonna wait for the glow gorilla knob to warm up and we'll fire her up thinking the generator light is on I can't see it in the video but I'm seeing that the glow plug salt shakers warming up let's give it a whirl she's been this is pretty much hasn't been started in about three months she is cold so we're gonna warm her up a little bit more and you can see the oil pressure goes right up Give it a quart. There we go. Like I said, this has been about three months or so. Oil pressure went right up. She is bone cold. It is about 30 degrees right now in Southern Oregon, so she is pretty cold. So I'll let her warm up a little bit and I'll show you the front of the engine and whatnot. There we go. And there she is. Good. Good oil pressure. Once she warms up a little bit, she'll smooth out. As you can see in the picture on the bottom, new starter, new cables. Got a new pre pump that was leaking before. It has a small leak of fuel there, but I was going to change that line. All the lines have gone through, all the injectors have been cleaned up. It's got kind of oil diesel. There she is. A little smoky, but it is also cold. But she is smooth for being what it is. No shaking, no weird of anything. There she is. Headlights work. You can kind of see there. I mean that bulb is burnt, but nonetheless. I do have extra parts for it. The front panel, some the jack, the front cowl. You have also the mat, which is nice and pliable. These are the parts, the carpets that I was keeping to recut new carpet for the front and the rear. Has a plate, has a bracket for the um, battery as well as the reservoir for coolant. I do have the caps, I took them off. I do have all four of the center caps. They're all complete. The uh, interior does work, radio gets static, but let's see. This is got their night turnover. Radio works, this is a factory radio. 
jumper near side, short arm it, and Lehman grabs his 11 board. Which is kind of neat. Dash is pretty much intact. Missing a couple little things, but the it's in there. Here's the center horn for the steering wheel, the rubber for the steering column, which goes right there. It does have the key. Everything else is pretty much intact. Um, interior, like I said, I do have that panel. The seats, this was the non headrest model that was started in 68, but you can adapt them if you want. Doors close like they should. No issues there. Trunk. And there should be. The primer spots you're seeing is not rust. This is stuff that I was starting to work on smoothing it out, getting it ready. And there she is after it warmed up a little bit. She's really smoothed out, running good. That hissing you hear is this is open. It's just air. Push it in. That, that hissing goes just the rubber. But it is responsive. Like I said, the diesel is old in it, but it still fires up. Thank you.